Yo, what is up everybody? This is Abrumanare. Oh, what? And we're here with our full episode for the weekend at Denmark 1939. It had the most requests of uh, what I had left, so that's what we're throwing down this weekend. As far as a plan, there isn't much of a plan that you can make besides just kick the Germans' ass. I mean, that's all you got going for you at first. Now, at some point, after we clear some shit out and we got Berlin, we'll, we'll throw down the heavies and put Manstein and Guderian on them and ship them off to Japan. But for now, we're just focused on taking out the Germans. Of course, I'll be using my artillery generals to help get the job done here. I will tell you this, it will be nice to finally have good units to take on Berlin and Goring. Because I've been using, what, crap units to try to take them out. Parachute units. Regular tanks. Now I got the big boys. Gonna be doing some work. Damn <laughs> That was fast. You made it to round four. Damn, 100. Oh, who would have guessed that Durnish would go up there, take that port, and then go one further so that he can be trapped and killed? I would have never guessed that that is what was going to happen there. Completely shocking. Nice. Yep, there he goes. He's trapped. He's screwed. Good job. What a jackass. Alright, we're, we're, we're thinning them out a little bit here. Go ahead and throw down my goring. Just in case I, I need to strafe anything. <laughs> Goring already got hit. What is going on? And they took back that. Well, crap. I might have to end up pulling Goring off there. Yeah, he's taking a lot of damage there. Of course, when we get Berlin out, he would probably not take much damage anymore. But I do need to... S keep the artillery coming out of there. Okay, I probably should, uh, in retrospect, I should have taken Berlin out before I ever put Goring down. Actually, I didn't even need to put him down. I, I, need, I needed more to keep producing the field artillery. I don't, in fact, now I, I'm questioning my logic. Like, why did I put him down? It's a damn fine question. One that I can't answer, bros. I don't know why I did that. I was just excited. I just wanted to get him down. I wanted him to do something. I mean, Goring can... Goring's just not all about air. I mean, he does a damn good amount of damage to infantry units. I 
I mean, it's not like that's just the only thing he can do. Oh damn, I didn't notice he was almost dead. I should have took him off of there. Put a new, a fresh one down. Actually, I wouldn't have had the money. Yeah, I would have. How much money am I getting around? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm getting a decent amount. Not too shabby for the, the little dab of crap I have. About to expand on that. Cologne goes down. We're making some damn good headway now. We gotta get back the stuff up here. Put Goring on Berlin. Maybe. I don't know how low of health he is. I was kind of, you know, wanting to save him up to take him with me to Japan. got back all that. We got a one-way focus now. No backtracking. Oh, they're gonna take Paris. Yep, there it is. But he took it with absolutely no health. I will make short work of that. And just like that, now we got Paris. Thank you. 
sacrifice. It had to be done. For the greater good of the, the country. People have to be sacrificed in order to keep the ball rolling. What's going on? Not, not too bad yet, but I better start, better start thinking about getting those heavies down. And of course with it I'll send some mechanized units, I'll send some armored cars. Take that, you damn Swiss. That'll teach you from never picking a side. And there you go. One's on his way out. Oh, Munich screwed. I had both generals lobbing rounds in on it. Get Goring on Paris, level a few things, and then send him off. Actually, I'm gonna have to keep him another round. I don't have as much money as I wanted. Nothing really needs... I can't really bomb anything. I guess I, I could have... Sit, well, I could... Take out the defense, I guess. I'm heading in the general direction of Chongqing again. As always, I guess. I don't need you anymore here, Goring. Go, go have some fun on the Eastern Front. The Axis powers are losing ground fast.
Someone needs to sacrifice themselves on that minefield. That should be about good. I don't think I need any other units. I can parachute into Africa. Clear this area out a little bit. There you go. Nice and nice and purdy. Maybe one more. Yep. Chong King just went down. Which means we can take it now. It's a Not, a, not again, bros. I am out of oil. We're going to have to remedy that these next couple rounds. I'm not even going to have enough oil to move all these guys up. Yep, that guy's out of oil. Are you kidding me? In true 1939 form, we're out of oil. We got 100 oil that round. We'll take that, take that, um, take that one. We'll spend two rounds just taking oil. I'm going to take a quick break here. I need a drink, and I forgot to bring it in here. All right, let's start this back up here. That right there, what I've done so far, should keep us in oil. I'm feeling pretty good about our oil situation now. Move out, bros. You got oil now. You know, I, r I run out of oils, you know, not very often. Not very often enough that I just forget, really, that you need oil. It's just something I, I, I encounter so rarely that when it happens, I'm just like, hold on, what's going on? Oh shit, oil! But I do remember we've encountered this before on our conquests. 
And in fact, it's usually when you're when you're playing with one of the smaller NATO countries that you get hosed. All right, Goring, you need to move your ass because shit's about to go down and you're you're lagging behind, bro. Let's go ahead and make sure that this isn't going to be a problem again. Anything else open? I don't think so. Alright, Spanish should be down right after we take this. We can strafe the other cities and they're gone. Boom, that got us two more oils. I think we're damn good on the oil front now. Go ahead and take this out. We got the money, we got the mains. Now, I only have to worry about Italy. Alright, we are getting, I'm gonna set up right here, and then next round, I'm gonna rush in. I need. You know what's coming, bros. You know the only reason I would be building artillery that far back off the front, in that location, is to hammer the shit out of the Swiss. Little bitches. You never pick a side. So I'm gonna pick one for you. Gonna get your ass kicked. Loosen this up right before I take Rome. Yeah, Zurich. I thought, I wasn't even really paying attention to who had that. I thought Germany was out a long time ago. Alright, moving in to the Chongqing area. Looks like it's going to be an easy, easy snatch and grab this time around. Not foreseen much problem grabbing it. Is 
Is that it for Italy? Oh, I still got that one. I got Naples. I forgot about that. I could bomb the shit out of it right now, but I really don't need to. I got plenty of shit to do over here. No need to rush. Waste money that I don't really need to be wasting. I don't have to go south. Looks like my allies help me out that way. Oh, a little bit of parachute spam. Just a little bit. Just a just a smidgen of parachute spam. Alright, Goring, you are holding up the process. Alright, all we got left now is the Japanese and the bastard Swiss. They must go down. Looks like Goring should be on Chongqing next turn. We can thin out some of that spam we got there. Yay! Fun time! Super fun time! Get some! Get some! Get some! You get some! I'm coming back! Give you a little bit more! You want some? You look like you need a little bit! Feeling pretty good now! Bomb the shit out of Peking! Nice and pretty purple. I didn't even realize how much I like the Denmark purple. Such a pretty little shade of purple. It's already time to get Goring on Shanghai. Peking's just like, you know what, F Goring, we're not waiting for him. Go ahead and take down Ulan Batar. We don't we don't need Goring. As far as that goes, we even take down Chang Chung because we don't need Goring. The guy's a fat ass. He eats too much. You know what, that setup right there is like always the same no matter what year you're in. Those land defenses. I have noticed that.
You know what? I was go I was going to do something cool, but I'm gonna have to do something less cool. I wanted to put Durance on a battleship, and the shithole port doesn't make a battleship. I wanted to see what kind of damage he could do to land bases, but now I can't. So maybe I'll. If I have time before it's destroyed, I'll try to get him to that Japanese aircraft carrier. I just want to have fun with him, you know? He's my new general. I haven't even got to do anything with him yet. He has no kills. He, he has, he's seen no combat. This is the first time he's ever even been deployed. We're getting close, guys. To wrapping this up. Once we get Massey and Guderian on land, it's it's a quick loss for the poor Japanese. Actually, Guderian might not even get a shot in. Oh, Tokyo is open. Good thing I had built a mechanized unit. So, I can't even get to the aircraft carrier. You bastards. That's not cool. Well, anyways, I guess this should be it then. I wanted to use Durance, but no. My allies are asshats. Well, there you have it, guys. We did it in 44 rounds. Not too bad. Anyways, bros, if you're enjoying this content, you know exactly what to do. Slap the shit. I like it. Subscribe, and I will see you back here for our next upload. Peace. Bruminati out.